Absolute Bowie has been voted one of the best tribute bands in the UK with their energetic and, of course, theatrical stage show. Um, I have with me John. John, can you introduce yourself on the band? Yeah, I'm the lead singer of the band and um, we love our job. It's the, I've got to have the best job in the world. You're jealous. <laughs> Everybody out there is jealous. Mm, I don't blame you either. John, you were uh, uh, great and you wowed the energised crowd. How was it for you? Right, I love playing outside. This is, I was born to do this, I feel. You know, this is a, a second coming for me, really. I, I should have sort of arrived from the womb straight onto stage, I, I reckon. But it, it just wasn't meant to be. So uh, later on in life, I got into it and I was really interested in Bowie and his music and his appeal and, and, and what he actually meant, which I never really worked out what Bowie meant or any of his songs, but I'm still sort of like delving deep to try and see if I can reach that point of understanding. Well, why did you decide to do Glaston Budget this year then? Um, uh, well, we, we do come and play for them every two or three years, uh, and it's a great crowd, it, it really is. It's, it's where all the tributes converge and, uh, and uh, everybody gets to, a chance to see, you know, some of the people that you have to pay like, 200 pounds to see you know yeah. and they're just as good sometimes and some of them are even dead and so like you know we sort of relive the, the, the experience of um, not seeing their heroes so the, um, it ticks every box really I think. John with, with Bowie obviously you had so many great hits how, how do you guys actually choose the ones you're going to perform because you, you're sport for choice really aren't you? We are there's just we've got so many to do and uh, well, we have a saxophonist, a uh, female, like, and she comes along with us, and that changes the set around completely. Uh, and the, and the, everybody loves a little bit of saxophone on stage, so it's great to sort of like be able to change the set around to what we did last time, so we keep it sort of fresh. But yeah, we have to play the uh, the anthems and, and the big ones, you know, the uh, people want to dance and sing to. So that's what we do. Yeah. Can you tell us who the band members are? Yeah, we have Chris Buratti on on, on the guitar and uh, Alex uh, Riccardi on drums, um, Alex uh, uh, Paolillo on, on the keyboards and uh, Fabio on bass, Fabio Cashi on bass. You've got a fantastic look John, I mean do you spend a lot of time uh, sort of uh, researching and practicing you know Bowie's um, his mannerisms and his moves and all yeah, that? Yeah very much so but I never saw him live uh, but so all I had really to research was video so that's what I did and uh, and, and, and uh, you know, even though I didn't get to see him, probably if I did get to see him, he would have been about that big, you know, and, uh, uh, but you know. So you, you never been... met him, clearly? No, never. What's your favourite Bowie track then? Um, right now, it, I, I, I've got a very strange imagination because my best track changes all the time. Now, I'm telling you, my best track is Black Star. Black Star, yeah. Yeah, it's epic. It, it really is, and it's something unlike any other Bowie song. And it, it's, it's a musical art in itself, and uh, you try and study the narrative. It, it, it really is. Uh, there's many points to look at, but I never really know what it means, and uh, never really, uh, never probably will ever know what it means. John, uh, you said let's dance, and that's exactly what the fantastic crowd did here at Glaston Budget today. Thanks for entertaining us. Thanks very much. Thank you. We really enjoyed every moment. I hope it showed. It did. It was fantastic. Good. Cheers. Thanks, John. Thank you, mate. Thanks a lot.